from the home of the Rays, Tropicana Field in St. Petersburg, Florida. Here it's the little guys on the big stage between the Arkansas Travelers and the Flying Squirrels of Richmond. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome your Flying Squirrels. Ready now is Noel Di Marte, and we are set for baseball here this evening. And the pitch on two and one. Hey. Called strike two. Two balls, two strikes, a crucial count for both pitcher and hitter. So, Dan, what was your approach on the mound in that count? Do you still pitch for the strikeout here? Action pitch right here, 2-2. Two, two. The last thing you want to do is to fall behind the count, 3-2. High and deep down the left field line. But this is just going to wind up being a foul ball. Sent on the ground out to second. He's got it. And he will whip this one over to first in time for the out. And now here is Luis Liberato. One out, nobody on. Liberato. Two balls and a strike. Two and two. He must know something we don't know. That was a center cut heater with count leverage in a big spot. I, I don't understand why he's taking. Hit in the air down the right field line. Matos back in plenty of time to put this away, however, and there are two gone. That now to the plate. Here is Dom Thompson Williams. Dom Thompson Williams. Into the windup, ready with the payoff pitch. Got him swinging in the dirt. And the throw to first ends the inning. Now into the box, Will Wilson. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The 1 1 home. Out in front of a fastball as this is ripped down the left field line. That's going to be a fair ball. The throw into second. And he's able to hustle he's his way up to second as he'll reach here with a two base hit. That is second. The seventh Elliot. Into the box, Elliot Ramos. And the knees for a called strike, and it's back to even at two and two. Hey, I love that pitch right there. Better execution after just giving up an extra base hit. Curveball got him swinging for the first down. That is good. Not shortstop. Marco. Lucy Hado. The 3 1. And that misses ball four. So it's first and second now with only one away. That is good. So runners at first and second here with one away. And that'll bring in Hunter Bishop. And he misses again. Ball four. And that's back to back guys now that have reached base via the base on ball. Digging in, the switch hitter, Patrick Bailey. And a golden opportunity here to give his guys the lead with three men aboard. I changed things up on him and he got him to swing through it. One and two now. Hey, you know the pitcher right now, he's looking for that best friend, that double play ball. In the dirt and block behind the plate. Good job to corral this quickly as the runners hold on. The 2 2. He's a called third strike right on the inside corner. Striding forward now is the DH, Luis Toribio. Certainly a big moment in this game. Bases loaded, tie score. The set and the 1 1. A ball and two strikes. Hey, this is a huge pitch right here. It would be demoralizing to watch this inning slip away. Hit sharply on the ground to the left. And that'll just sneak past his outstretched arm, a base hit. And not in time as the run scores. And the run is in to score from second. It's a 2 0 ball game. That is that. The first baseman, Jason. At the plate, Jason Krizan. Off speed pitch in the dirt as he takes it for a ball. This inning hasn't gone the way he wanted it to, but it's not a total disaster yet. Sometimes pitching is about damage control, so if he can strand these guys out there, that would be pretty huge. 
Thompson Williams able to track it down for the third out. Second inning set to go and standing in the outfielder Jack Larson. You know these next couple innings are really important for these guys. I know they're only down by a couple but they need to get something going on offense to keep pace even though it's early two and one the count into the windup and the pitch There's a fastball on the inner third taken for a strike. Trying to okay. nibble here and he misses to run it full now three and two. Well you don't see it all that often but this might be a good time for a three two change if he can locate it it's nearly impossible to hit. Payoff pitch one more time. A little dribbler up the third baseline. The next three two. Now a swing and a fly ball. Matos is over near the stands as he makes the catch for the first down. So here is Jansen Witty. Number 12. Jansen Witty. Ball two. When a pitcher puts you in the proverbial rocking chair like he's doing right now, you have to take a deep breath. You can't start trying to guess along with them. Trust your fundamentals and stay on that fastball. Matos is there and he'll bring this one in. That Next, is. it'll be Jake okay. Shiner. He'll work on keeping okay. this top of the second alive. And here's a ball hit in the air. And this will wind up a foul ball. Something has to give. Here's the payoff pitch. Bases are empty here with two men out. And That's a fastball ball misses there. Ball four. To the plate now is the designated that, hitter, that. Marcus Wilson. He takes his first cuts Marcus. in this one with a man at first and Wilson. two away. Ready to deal. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Well, he's been laboring a bit for these one. first two innings of work. That's... 37 pitches and ideally he'd be closer to 27 instead two and two a bouncer up the middle fielded cleanly and as it turns out the two out walk doesn't come around to haunt him as that ends the inning. half of the second set to go and set to go is the third baseman Jacob Gonzalez set to deal on a ball and two strikes hit high and deep to left field but that'll stay in the park as it's off the wall and he's going to get to second now with nobody out Blake now Luis Matos one and two now as that one's fouled off working for the punch out and the offering this one's flared out toward left left fielder coming on he slides and brings it in nice play there for out number one now that so the lineup the flips baseman. over and digging in Will Wilson. He doubled his last time up. And he's got to build off that last A.B. He battled. Usually when you battle, you get in that swing mode. A lot of pitches, you'll swing at the rosin bag. I love the fact that he was able to work a double in last at bat. Let's see if we get more of the same right here. The one-two. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Thompson Williams is there now and he has it to gone. So now here is Elliot Ramos, runner in scoring position with two The 2-2 two -two pitch. Look out. Don't want to hit him there. It's full three and two. That was a changeup, so there really wasn't any intent behind it. Looked to me like it just slipped out of his hand a little bit. That'll happen sometimes because of the grip of that straight changeup. 
Once again, a 3-2. Down the third baseline. The That's missile gets foul, so they'll do it again. Three and two. Payoff pitch one more time. And that misses. Ball four. So it's first and second now with two out. Stepping in next, Marco Luciano. Two's all over the place. Two on, two out, and of course, here in inning number two. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. Well, this has been a long inning already, and I know he doesn't want it to get any longer. I expect a challenge pitch right here. Hit the other way out toward right field. And the inning will end as they're unable to cash in with two outs. New inning set to get underway and set to go is the second baseman, Caden Polkovich. Lays off the slider that time, two and one. The offense better get it going right here because they certainly can tell from their dugout. This guy is carrying himself with a presence out on the mound. He's got feel for all his pitches. Maybe trying to back him up a bit there with the fastball. You do not want to walk the eight-hole hitter. It just opens up so many options. Do we bunt them over to second with the nine-hole hitter? Do we try and play for that big rally with the top of the order coming up? This is a huge pitch. You can't allow this guy to walk. So now to the plate, Josh Morgan. Josh Morgan. From the windup, the 1-1 pitch. Fouled off. Hit to short. And that's the second out. Now at the plate, here is Noel V. Marte. He bounced out last time up. Marte. The 3 1. Breaking ball swung on and grounded to second. Scooped up. Throw to first, beats him easily, and the side is retired. Stepping in is Hunter Bishop worked a walk in his first plate appearance. Into the windup, here's the two and one pitch. Now a big fastball, and he's well behind it with the swing. Line drive, that's a base hit into the right center field gap. The catcher, Patrick. Into the box now, Patrick Bailey. He chased a bad ball up out of the zone, two and two. Oh, and there's the good curveball as he set down on strikes for the second time here tonight. Now And stepping in, Luis Toribio. He was able to plate two with a base hit in his first appearance. Now the one and one pitch. Bishop leads off first with one away. Off speed pitch, and there is strike three called. And boy, that zone just got a bit larger. Two away. The first baseman. So now into the box is Jason Krizan. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Now a throw over to first. Runners back. One one home. Hey. He's looking pretty passive here, hitting with a chance to drive in a run. Going to have to make something happen with two strikes now. Tried well, to shoot the corner the and he missed it. Two and two. We just saw a fastball right there. I would not be shocked if he tries to get this guy to go fishing right here and drops a little off-speed pitch in the, the dirt. Count is full. And that's low, so a good eye there as he works the count back full. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Thompson Williams will get there and he puts it away to retire the side. All set for the start of the fourth and at the plate will be the speedy outfielder Luis Liberato. 
Here's the one and one delivery. Good fastball as he gets the swing and miss. Hold the string on him. Strike three swinging. Bailey has it. The throw to first is in time. One down. Striding in is Dom Thompson Williams. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. This one sinks low and a touch outside. It's a full count three and two. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. Matos is there. Two down. And now in the box, Jack Larson flew out last time up. Two out, nobody on. And he fouls this one off. Hey, usually the second time through the order, you start seeing an incorporation of some more off-speed stuff. But this guy's locating, feeling really good about his fastball. Two back-to-back. -back. Swing and a liner toward the gap in left center. Base hit, and they're into the hit column. The first base is number 12, Jansen. So now Whitty. to the plate, Jansen Witte. Oh, He's fallen behind now, three and one. Back up the middle, and that's through for a base hit. Make him one for two in this one. Now back, third base. Standing in now, Jake Shiner. Three and two, full count. Larson on second, Whitty at first, two out in the inning. Grounded to short. He's right there. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as the side is retired. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And that'll give way to the third baseman, Jacob Gonzalez. The one-two. It's a curveball taken low for a ball. So you'd love for him to offer at that one, but the execution was flawless. Nice curveball that starts in the zone and breaks just out. Just a great take by the batter. Polkovic backs up a bit and he takes charge for the first out. At the plate right now field. is Number Luis one. Matos. Flied Louis. out in his first at bat, so making 0 for 1 so far. 1 1. This is line to left. And that'll get by and on through towards the wall. Around first, digging for two. Around second, he's on his way to third. And he's in there at third with a one out triple. Number two. Second baseman. To the plate now, Will Wilson. Wilson. Swing and a miss, and two it's a strikes. ball and two strikes here. You could tell by the hitter's balance after that swing that he's seeing the ball really good. His timing is right there, and I expect him to catch something clean. Right fielder coming on, but he won't get there. It falls in, and not in time as the run scores. Brandon Williamson answers the call from the pen here in the fourth as they didn't get the outing they were hoping for from their starter. In now, Elliot Ramos. Now this is on the ground at first. We'll see if they can get two. On to first, and talk about doing the job out of the bullpen. One batter, two outs, and the inning is over. Highway Tank will take the ball now as the new pitcher. Now pitching for the world, number 51. Stepping up is Marcus Wilson. He's 0 for 1 thus far. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. Grounded down the third baseline. But a foul ball, 1 and 2 now. Fastball, but that's easy to lay off, and it's back to even at two and two. And it's fouled away. And that will never threaten.
threatened the zone. It's gone full now to three and two. Looked to me like he tried to do way too much on that 2-2 pitch. You don't have to come into the zone on that count, but a pitch that far outside isn't going to tempt anyone to swing. Payoff pitch on its way. Popped him up. Wilson is calling for it. He's got it one away. Next now up that, is Kaden Polkovich. Kaden Bases Polkovich. are empty, one man out. And it's one and two. Someone on this offense needs to take it upon themselves to have a quality A-B and start the line moving again. And this is swung on and missed, so it's two up, two down to start the fifth. Now back. So next to bat will be Josh Morgan. Morgan. Set and the 1 1 pitch. Well, now a good pitch around the knees, but it doesn't quite catch the bottom of the zone. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. But this will wind up a foul ball. Two and two. Now the pitch. Slow roller out to short. Reined in. Over to first, and that retires the side. Digging in will be Marco Luciano. Fastball swung on and missed for the first down. That's going to bring up Hunter now Bishop. Back. Last time well, through was a base hit. Hunter. And the pitch. I got three one. Three balls, one strike. Not definitely a fastball swing there, but a good time for the changeup. It's full three and two. Hey, there was great arm action on that 3-1 changeup right here. He's got this guy thinking. That's the beauty right now. We go now to a full it. count. Catcher. Do you sit changeup? Or do you stay with the heater? So he ran the fastball by him for the punch out. Hunter Bishop becomes out number two this Outside. inning. The count now at two and one. Can't connect there. It's two and two. Boy, he looks strong out there on the mound this inning. He's got a chance to punch out the side in order and against the middle of the order, too. And the inning will continue as that's through for a two out hit. Now that the designated hitter, Louis. Stepping in now, Luis Toribio. Here's a drive out toward left center field. Runner from first cross plate. Now back, first baseman, Jason. Into the box, Jason Krizan. To one and two now. Hey, last two pitches back to back, off speed, then he's laid on the fastball. He could pretty much do anything he wants right here on the mound. And he goes the other way with it, high and deep down the left field line. And now it'll kick around in the corner. He pulls into second safely as a run will score on the play as well. Now back, the third baseman, Jacob Gonzalez. At the plate now, Jacob Gonzalez. Swing and a liner. And no trouble for him as he makes the catch to end the inning. Now at the plate, Noel V. Marte, 0 for 2 for him to this point. The 2 1 home it is a fastball down below the knees. Three and one. Full count now, three and two. Hey, it's tough when your team is being held scoreless on the scoreboard. He was trying to put him on the board with a swing like that one. And there's his first base hit in this one. The left fielder, number 29. At the plate, Luis Liberato. Liberato. Lined hard to center field. 
Ramos is there, and he has it for the first down. Next, here is Dom Thompson Williams. He struck out and flied out, 0 for 2 so far. Now the 2 1 is laid off of for ball number three. This is why the manager pencils these guys in in the middle of the order. Big spot, time for them to get back in this game with a couple quality ABs. Full count now, three and two. Now the payoff pitch home. And he popped him up. And no one can get there. It's a foul ball. Ah. On pitch number 10 is the one that finally does it as he strikes out after a long the battle here. Next Jack. to stand in is Larson. Jack Larson. It was a base hit last time up. From the belt. Kicks and deals. Changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for a ball. Too high that time, and it's three and one. Jansen Witte would be next. And a fastball swung on and hit to second. Fielded cleanly. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Luis Matos, he made it to third on a triple in his previous appearance. Into the windup, here comes the 2-2 pitch. Swing and a miss as he ran the fastball right by him for the first down. Nobody. Now it'll be Number Will two. Wilson, two Second for three base, with a double on his line Will. so far. Will Even the ball and a strike, here's the pitch. Now, two more. In the air to straightaway center field. Center fielder on the run. He makes the play. Really had to hustle to get to that one. Two gone now. Center fielder. That'll bring up Elliot Ramos. Elliot. 0 for 2 with a walk Ramos. for him so far. Three balls and a strike. Here's the pitch. Sharp ground ball to third. Throw cleanly oh. into first, and that ends the inning. Seventh inning ready to roll. And here comes the first baseman, Jansen Witte. The 2 2. Sent in the air out to straightaway center. And the seventh inning starts with a fly out here, one away. Next to hit, Jake Shiner grounded out in his last at bat. One out, nobody on. Fouled away. Now another one, two. Way oh, inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. This is on the ground over to first. Throw on to first, two gone. So next to hit is Marcus Wilson. He flew out in his last A-B. Bases are empty here with two men out. Dribbled to the right side. Here comes the one-two. Grounded weakly down the line toward third. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Yeah. 
last half of the seventh here and stepping up as the shortstop Marco Luciano. Here comes the one two. Nope. Outside. Right side but it's going to be a foul ball. Ready with another two two. High in the air down the right field line. And no one will track it down. Now another 2-2. Two -two. Swing and a high chopper. And that's the first down. Now with the plate is Hunter Bishop. He went down on strikes last time up. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this A.B. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he now swings that. and misses for the second the out. Two right. out, nobody on. Holy. And now a curveball that's low and in the dirt for a ball. It's two and one. Hit in the air to shallow center. Center fielder giving chase. He gets there to make the play, and that ends the inning. Ready to begin the eighth, and that'll bring in the second baseman, Caden Polkovich. The 1 1. Now he spins on one here and drives it to deep right field. And that ball will stay fair, and it's gone. A home run. Carlos Sano is on to pitch here in the eighth with nobody out. Number 36, Carlos. Standing in now, Josh Morgan. And it's two balls and two strikes now. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. Next to dig in, Noel V. Marte singled in his last at bat. Noel V. Marte. And not a real good cut at that slider, and he's behind one and two. Yeah, guys, he's got so much respect for this guy's fastball, you could tell he was out in front on that slider. I think he goes to the well one more time with that pitch. So he so sets him down swinging. Noel V. Marte goes down for out number two in the top half. To two and two now. One's flared down the right field line. And that's in there. Base hit. Throw into second. And he's able to hustle he's his safe. way up to second as he'll reach here with a two base hit. Now that the center fielder, Dom Thompson Williams. So now to the plate, Dom Thompson Williams. Struck him out. Struck him out again, I should say. His third punch out of the game. Bottom of inning number eight set to go and striding forward the designated hitter Luis Toribio. Tough curveball that time but he's able to make a little contact to keep this at bat going. Swing and a ball hit on the ground and the throw to first is in time one gone. Next up, Jason Krizan. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. 5 1 our score as we play the eighth. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Listen, I'm not trying to make up an excuse, but this is this guy's fifth inning of work in this game out of the bullpen. Are you kidding me? Nobody goes five innings anymore. And he will make the play. Two away now. Up next, now Jacob batting. Gonzalez. He's working on a one for three thus far. Bases are empty here with two men out. Now the fastball is swung out and missed. One and two. He's going to have to set his sights a little lower right there. That pitch was able to get by him. His swing was just a little under that one. And the throw to first will indeed get him. It's a strikeout score at two to three, and the inning is over.
So kicking off the top of the ninth is Jack Larson. And they could use a spark from him here. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Fastball just inside. The count is two and one. Unable to find the zone with the slider. Boy, that's a nasty breaking ball right there. Backdoor slider. Just missed the corner. As they say, oh, that's, that's a Hall of Fame pitch. And this pitch misses here. It's ball four. And they've got a leadoff base runner aboard to start the ninth. Just behind the fastball there. Two strikes now. Threw that fastball right by him. He had no chance to get the barrel. Swung on and missed. Really fooled him that time for the first out. Digging in next, Jake Shiner. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. Nope. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Hey, after those two breaking balls missed, you have to be sitting on a fastball right here. Takes a good swing, but this will be a foul ball. Larson, the runner at first, with one gun in the inning. And this misses, so that'll fill the count at three and two. Not a bad time right here to put that runner in motion. Three, two count. You send the runner, and if it's a bad pitch, it's ball four. And this is going to find the seam as it scoots through on the carpet for extra bases. And the run will score all the way from first. Tyler Sear answers the call from the dugout as he'll try to record the final two outs of this one. to the plate now. Marcus Wilson on the ground back up the box and it'll get through into center field a base hit. Now, this is well up the line and he's safe at home playing. In now Caden Polkovich can't keep the weight back and he falls behind one and two. Working for the punch out and the offering. Swing and a looper to left. In comes the left fielder. He gets there and makes the play for the second out of the inning. Into the box, Josh Morgan. He comes to the plate as the last chance for his side. Two out here in the ninth. Too close for comfort, and he did a good job just to make contact. Them down to their final strike. Here it comes. And he takes ball four. So a good job out of the nine hole in getting on base as we go back to the top of the order. Two down runners at first and second. And now a fastball, but he's able to hold off on it, and it's two and one now. Hey, this isn't going to be an easy save. These guys are making it work for this one. Popped him up. Bailey waits on it. Makes the catch, and that's the ball game. Hey, this was a pretty tightly played game. Got a little bit of everything in this one. Some timely hitting, runs on the board, key pitching, and defense in certain spots. This one was a fun one to watch. And this evening's contest comes to a close. 5-3, the final. The Flying Squirrels jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Highway Tang is the winning pitcher of record. Juan Ten couldn't escape the fourth inning as he slapped with the loss. So that's a wrap for us here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Mark DeRozan, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. And for more, click over to theshow.com. our final line score. First for your victorious home team. Five runs on nine hits. No errors. They left seven men on base. For the Travelers, three runs on seven hits. No errors. They left seven men on base.